Okay, so for in-market segments on Google Ads, you can reach users who are in the market for a specific product or service. With in-market segments, you can target people who have shown an interest in purchasing something based on the websites that they're visiting, based on the things that they are typing into Google, based on the videos that they're watching. They are available for your search, display, video, discovery, and shopping campaigns. So you can use in-market segments across every single campaign type besides hotel ads. So let's get into it and let's go over some different in-market segments and how you can add them to your campaign. So if we open up our Google Ads account here, what we can do is just click to create a new campaign and let's just say we wanna create a new display campaign that's driving sales. So we'll choose our conversion goals, we'll choose our campaign type, so a display campaign. We could enter our website here and do our campaign name, but we're gonna click on continue. Now once you have all your campaign settings as far as your location targeting and language targeting, your budget, your bidding, we get into targeting. So with targeting, one thing you might see is optimized targeting is set up for you. So it's gonna help you get more conversions by using your landing page, your advertisements, your ad copy, all the information that Google Ads can actually take from your campaign, they're gonna to use to try to drive you more conversions. So when we click on ad targeting, one of the audience segment options here, so we're suggesting who should see our ads. If we come over here to browse, you're gonna see in market and life events. So if we come and we click on it, we have in market segments here, we can click on the drop down, and you're gonna see all of these different categories of in market segments. So if we're saying somebody is in market for home and garden, that means that in general, they're researching home and garden products to purchase. Now, if you scroll over any of these audiences, they'll give you a quick little overview. So people interested in purchasing home and garden products such as furniture, home improvement supplies, and home security. So if you're clicking on one of these categories, it's gonna be very broad. So when we get into the drop down, you can start getting into some of these more relevant categories. So let's say I am trying to sell home appliances, and let's say I'm trying to sell dishwashers. I can come in here and I can select dishwashers, and this will reach people who are in the market for a dishwasher. People interested in purchasing dishwashers, so top related audience segments, refrigerator accessories, food service equipment, home appliances, top YouTube categories. We can see weekly available impressions here, 50 million to 100 million available impressions by using this in-market segment. Now what you can also do, rather than coming to the list of pre-selected in-market segments, is we can come back over here, we'll get rid of this one for now, come to search, and let's just say we wanna search dishwashers. So what you're gonna see, and sometimes they come up at the top here, but right at the top, these are all different in-market segments. Dishwashers, washers and dryers, refrigerators, microwaves. So they're gonna pull up some of the most relevant in-market segments, but as we scroll down, you're gonna see something called in-market other. So in-market other, they have dishwashers, they have commercial dishwashers, they have dishwasher cleaning products, KitchenAid dishwashers and parts, dishwasher parts and repair services. So even if you're just searching something like dishwashers, you can find all of these different things that people may be in the market for. So for example, if you sell dishwashers, and you sell installation, and you sell parts and repair services, you may wanna select some of these different in-market segments, and you can target people with different advertisements and different offers. Somebody who's looking for dishwasher installation has likely already purchased a dishwasher, and now they just need someone to come and install it. If somebody who's looking for dishwasher parts and repair services likely already has their dishwasher, they're just looking to make sure their dishwasher keeps working and doesn't stop working. And if it has stopped working, then they're looking for repair services. So some different ways that you might wanna look at in-market segments. And if we come through here and search pretty much anything, you're gonna find a huge selection of different in-market segments. And keep in mind, these are people that are actively searching to purchase something. So if we do this quickly, we come into browse, we go to in-market segments, let's just scroll down to sports and fitness. Click on the drop down, sporting goods. Somebody might be searching for golf equipment. Somebody might be searching for winter sports equipment and accessories. So if you look over here at top YouTube categories, snowboarding gear, ice skating equipment, skiing equipment. So people interested in purchasing winter sports equipment or accessories such as snowboard goggles, skis, and snowshoes. So if you sell all of those products, this would be a great audience for you to target and see if you can drive some more conversions. And then what you can also do is always come in here to search and let's say you're selling headphones. 
So this one started with a lot of the in-market other at the very top. So wireless earbuds and earphones, high quality headphones, master and dynamic headphones, Apple earbuds. So you're starting to see some of these more relevant categories. So if, for example, you're selling very high quality headphones that are much more expensive than a lot of the other options that people have on the market, you probably want to target this audience rather than just a broad audience related to headphones. So these are in-market audiences. All you need to do is select this audience here and they will be added to your campaign. We can click on done and now we're targeting people who are actively researching or planning to buy high quality headphones. And what we can do is target people with advertisements related to high quality headphones, send them to a landing page that only lists high quality headphones for sale. And we have ourselves a nice relevant and targeted ad campaign. So if you have any questions about in-market segments, this is what in-market segments are. Thanks for watching my video today and make sure you subscribe to the Surfside PPC YouTube channel.